Okay, I'm back on. So, it is a little scratched up on the door, but it's around the key box. So, I think it's from all the people that have come in. Um, hello? Just making sure no one's home because it was a going show, but I'm a little late. So, all right, this is the family room. It's really nice. It starts over here, so all this way down. It's a kind of a rectangular shape. And it has a stone fireplace at the end, and the vaulted ceiling makes it look really nice. It has like a textured carpet. Um, I see a couple of stains, but you could clean it and see what happens with that and then replace it if, if you wanted to. Oh, this is a big old kitchen. Like, real. Oh. Here's the family room lit up, so you can really see it. Ooh, I love their pillows. Those are my kind of pillows. And then, here's the gigantic kitchen. So, big eat-in kitchen. I mean, this thing is huge. You could definitely put a very nice island in the middle of this kitchen. Like, on where the, the edge of the rug is right there all the way across and right here you could build a huge island uh with the like a eat up like the kids could eat up the island and you could have all kinds of extra storage but there are plenty of cabinets in here and countertop space like a lot there are oak, older oak cabinets which can be left or painted Stainless appliances mostly. There is not a microwave, but usually you can replace that vent with a microwave if one would fit under that cabinet. Dishwasher, window over sink. It doesn't have a real tiled floor. It looks like tile. The linoleum made to look like tile, the vinyl, but um, of course you could easily, again, even though this room is pretty big, so, if you did real tile in here, it'd cost a lot. If you did the, um, you know, the new um, wood-like vinyl, it wouldn't be very much. And then, this is a huge storage space. It actually goes all the way down. So, this is your pantry. This is just gigantic. Let me go around. And they do have newer light fixtures or more modern light fixtures. So here's the other side to that, which is a coat closet. So this is kind of like your coat closet backslash pantry. I think that goes down to the garage. We'll do that later. I just can't get over how wide this kitchen is. So let's look in the back and see what's back here. Oh, it's a nice deck. It's newer, definitely. So you don't have to worry about that. The, all the railing is brand new. Brand new wood. So you have to let this sit for a little while. And then once it's aged, then you can stain it or paint it. There's the AC. It looks newer too. They do have a fence around part of the backyard. I think this property might go back a little deeper into the woods. I'd have to look, but from the road to the front of the house is gigantic. So I'm sure they fenced this in for a doggy. And there are flat areas like right up there. And then there's a little bit of a slope and then a more flat area over on this side for the kids, of course. And the slope isn't that, it's not like a big deep hill or anything, um, but that's good because that means the rain goes away from your house. But again, back here, it's a lot of leaves um, instead of, you know, just grass, but landscaping. River rocks, little pebbles, pond straw, bark does wonders. Here's the back. It looks to be in really good shape, except for the gutters need to be cleaned out. But the gutters look good. And the eaves underneath and the soffits and all of that stuff look in to be in good shape. Um, let's go see the bedrooms now. Oh, sorry. Let me get this door locked back. This kitchen is so big. And there's a little hand drill up the steps, 
And then you come to the first bathroom on the right. The hall bathroom. It has a long vanity with lots of cabinets, but only one sink. So with the kids, you could probably change that to a two sink if you could get the plumbing under there done. And then they do have it painted green, so it's a little darker in here. A lighter color would definitely lighten it up in here. Just a regular combo. And it does have a skylight. So that would be something we would want to get checked out. But all of the countertops are just the regular kind of countertops, but they're in really good shape. The next room on the right is the primary. It's not vaulted or anything, but it feels big in here. Um, it feels really big in here, actually, so it's nice. 